Hey guys, today we have this 2007 Lexus RX350 and we're gonna be programming a another key. On the right side is a master key and the left side is an unprogrammed key. And we'll be using this Autel KM100 to program it. All right, let's get started. Okay, so first let's try it. I'm gonna show you, this is the master key. Start the car with no problem. As you can see, then remove that one. Let me get to try this one. We just cut it. it, goes in pretty good, but it doesn't start. So, crank that up real quick. So that one started. We're gonna go ahead and program this one here. So we'll be using the Autel KM100, Maxim KM100. So we got the Bluetooth, we had it connected underneath already. So you can see that's connected. So let's turn off the car. We'll leave the key on the ignition, on position though. <clears throat> and then we're gonna go to transponder function. I mean, emo. Let's go to emo. Let's go to emo. So let's go to Lexus, Lexus, <clears throat> and then let's go to automatic selection. We'll see if we can read this one. Let's go read it. It's reading the there you go, pretty fast. It's good. <clears throat> Decode the VIN. There you go, press OK. It says 3.30, did you see that? Automatic selection. Let's go read it again. That is crazy. Press OK. This one said RX 330. Hmm. Uh, no, it's 350. Let me just check in the back. It just made me curious. I thought it was a 350. See that? It did say 350. Huh? But this one says the system is 330. So it's okay. All right. Emo status scan. I'm just gonna go to control unit and then immobilizer. Number of keys. <clears throat> Let's see how many keys do we have. <coughs> All right, I had to sneeze. There you go. Let's go key learning. Insert the learn master key and turn the ignition on and press OK. It's on, press OK. Remove the key, insert the one need to be learned and leave it on that lock position, which is the off position and do not turn to on and wait. Look at that, it says learning is complete. That was pretty quick. So what I'm gonna do, try to start it. It does it. You know why? I think we have the maximum key that we have. That's why it doesn't start. So let's see if we can erase key here. <clears throat> Insert the learn master key. Press OK to continue. OK. Master key. Press OK. <clears throat> Let's see how number of keys do we have. There you go. One master key. Okay. I think we reached the, the, the maximum of maximum key. That's why you didn't program it. So I delete everything. <clears throat> Press it on again. Let's go learn the key one more time. Press OK. All right, let's remove it. Then put this key here. Just leave it in off position. There you 
you go. <clears throat> Still in there. We'll keep it learning. It says wait for about 75 seconds. And we're still on the 50, 50 seconds mark. <clears throat> well, actually, it's a countdown. So make sure I just leave it there. All right. Just got to keep waiting, guys. This one takes a little while to program. Well, I guess in a minute, less than a minute. So, or less than two minutes, because it's 75 seconds. So, hopefully, this doesn't fail. It, it fell on us, I think, because it's already in six keys. It has a maximum key already. So, we just erased it and then put this one master key so we can program another one. Learning is complete. Let's try it again. Right, guys, there you go. That's it. So that thing is learned. Fine, let's try this again. Original key is still good, as you can see. Let's do it one more time. All right, that's it, guys. And let's see the number of keys that we have. <clears throat> two keys, two master keys. All right, guys. There you go, guys. That was pretty quick. Make sure that you don't over six number of keys for this car because it will not program another one. In that case, you just erase it if you know that there's, you don't have any other working key. So this is the only keys that you'll be using. That's fine to erase it and then program another one. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Till next time. Peace.